Europe has been increasing scrutiny on China. The EU has been reassessing its traditional openness to trade with China. Governments fear possible security risks posed by Chinese companies. And now another case of potential spyanese chying has made news. Belgium's intelligence services are monitoring Chinese e-commerce company Alibaba. Alibaba's logistics arm at a cargo airport in the city of Liege is under surveillance. A major area of concern is that the company's software systems can collect sensitive economic information. The logistics arm, called Kainiao, can also access information about consumers. What makes the situation of urgent concern is that, according to a legislation, Chinese companies are obligated to share data with Chinese authorities. Experts say that knowledge about important changes in consumption patterns and knowledge about the logistical chain is valuable for China as a country that tries to dominate the supply chain. Although a nation trying to dominate the market is fine, what if the information is used for non-commercial purposes? What if the data is used to attack the nation's vulnerabilities? Such acts would concern Belgium's state security services. The security services say that it is trying to detect and fight against possible spying and interference activities carried out by Chinese entities, including Alibaba. Following the accusations against Alibaba, its logistics arm has denied the allegations and says that it follows all laws and regulations. So, why is Belgium acting so late? We ask this because in 2018, Alibaba signed an agreement with the Belgium government. The company was allowed to open an e-commerce trade hub, which included investments in logistics infrastructure. Concerns on potential espionage were first raised before the hub was built, but Kainiao denied the accusations and said that data security and privacy protection was of paramount concern to the business. Will Belgium be able to take strong actions against China this time? It could take inspiration from Germany. Last year, the German government blocked the sale of a semiconductor factory to China due to security fears. Berlin did the same when Chinese shipping giant Costco was scheduled to buy a stake in the operator of a Hamburg port terminal. Following decades of relative openness to China, recent incidents prove that the West is now more cautious of Chinese companies. Will Belgium prove their suspicions right? How long will China keep denying the allegations?